Do you expect Charles to be a similar monarch to his mother or a completely different monarch? Well, there clearly will be similarities. Um, His uh, uh, duty uh, to serve is clearly going to be there. Um, But with all individuals, he will be different. There's no doubt about that. And don't forget the Queen, you know, she was Queen at 25, I believe. So she had numerous years um, uh, to uh, perfect her role. But she didn't have many years in training. The the Prince of Wales has had had many, many, many years in training. Um, So he will sort of probably take on the the, the role of kingship in a a different manner to the the Queen. But uh, I have no doubt in terms of um, his duty, he will be uh, exactly exemplary like, like the Queen has been. So you think it's in his nature to to follow the protocols as the Queen has adhered to so strongly or do you expect that he might branch out and be more political and make his views known more widely? I have absolutely no, um, how should I put it, no compunction that he will uh, follow the the role of the Queen. I mean, it's great, it's a huge difference between being the Prince of Wales and having your own opinion than being the monarch. As the monarch, you really, you may have personal opinions, clearly, but you can't express them. The Prince of Wales is an individual and he has certain um, aspects that are very important to him, like the environment, architecture, um, his charities. And clearly, as the Prince of Wales, you, you um, can express your opinions, but once you're the monarch, uh, you certainly can't. And you can't be seen to be influencing um, ministers, etc. Privately, perhaps you can, but certainly in the public uh, arena, you can't be. And I think the, the Queen has been exemplary in that uh, fashion, and I have no doubt that, the, um, that King Charles will, will be the same. As Prince Charles, his personal motto was, I serve. Throughout his life, you know, how keenly has he felt the responsibility of his role? Throughout his whole life, I think when you appreciate that you are going to assume the mantle of kingship, um, you you know, you are slightly different. I mean, the Queen and uh, Princess Margaret uh, behave differently, uh, and the Prince of Wales, um, as uh, King Charles was, was different to his brothers, and I think you can see it um, between William and Harry. One is always going to be the uh, the monarch, and the other has a little bit more freedom. And that certainly played out with um, uh, King Charles as the Prince of Wales. Uh, he was much more serious than perhaps his um, uh, younger uh, siblings, as you can see uh, Prince William is um, in comparison to Prince Harry. So. Uh, he was very conscious of the fact that he was going to be king and uh, and taken his responsibilities um, very seriously. Uh, and, uh, you know, he is there to serve and he, he appreciates that. Hello, I'm Tara Brown. Thanks for watching 60 Minutes Australia. Subscribe to our channel now for brand new stories and exclusive clips every week. And don't miss out on our Extra Minutes segments and full episodes of 60 Minutes on 9now.com.au and the 9Now app.